Welcome to Crash Bandicoot Warped Platinum Relics Part 1. Now, unlike the other two games, I don't have a 100% complete save file. This game's a bit different though, because you unlock, you have to do the relics to unlock all the gems anyway. So I'm just starting with the relics and I will 100% complete the file just as I go along. Now we already have five gold relics and one sapphire relic. So it looks like I did attempt the relics when I did my original series because of the fact that you need to do them for the completion. The good news is none of them are platinum, so that just shows I guess that was pretty shit when I first attempted them. I don't know how tough this game will be, but apparently it's the easier one of the three. So let's jump into Toad Village. So I've got my speed shoes. Now this game, unlike the other two, was actually designed with relics in mind. So I don't know if I need to do the spin sliding stuff or the slide jumping stuff or if speed shoes is enough. I think it looks slightly more faster. Okay, wait, no, that's probably not the faster way of doing it. I don't know, that's the end of the level, but it doesn't... It doesn't fit... Oh, okay, it was platinum. How did I not get that the first time I tried this? How did I get gold the first time? Hey, I'll take a first try. It, I got a 54 seconds the first time. There's no way I had speed shoes. Well, on to a level that's probably going to be quite difficult. Under pressure. 103. My best time is 110. Now, assuming I've improved... Uh, these relics in any capacity. This should not be that difficult to, to, to improve on. Good start. I've just got to memorize where the crates are and where I can spin. Okay, no, no, I did that on purpose. I wanted to restart. I wanted another shot at this because uh, this crate here Let's just go. Okay, there's an Aku there. That's good to know. Hopefully I'm not missing any crates that are like behind the plants and shit. Because I know that's a thing. There's a three crate. Make sure we get to the bottom level so we can see. I missed a crate. No, I seen it. I missed a crate. It's in the fucking thing. This could have been platinum. Oh, I missed another one. Wait, how do you get them? Okay, remember. Oh, I didn't, I didn't get the fucking thing. No wonder I missed it. I was wondering, yeah, that's probably what it is, but I didn't see it. Oh, that's slow. No, 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 no. We should have greeted that. That's very slow. We should have greeted. Oh, fuck. Oh, well, it's over. I missed it again. Yeah, so you can boost in the vehicle. That should make things slightly easier. Oh, there's a crate there. I didn't even see that crate. I don't actually know if I've been grabbing that this whole time. I probably have because I've been getting the Accu Crate, but I didn't know that that was there. See, you know, see how much easier that is? Not easier, but just quicker. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now, that's quick. Let's just use an Accu because... Well, 
I, I didn't even want to do that, but... If I just spam this right, I should be good. There we go. Easy. All we had to do was, you know, use the intended mechanic of going faster. Okay, I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot more than Crash 2 right now. Because let's compare the first two of these levels to the first two of Crash 2's levels. Turtle Woods and Snow Go. But no, within 10 minutes, I've already got two Platinum Relics. This is, this is much better. Let's see what 3 is. Okay, this... Might be a bit trickier. At the very least, it's a good level, so. Right. We just gotta memorize where everything is, because we're going extremely quick. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. This is, uh... Oh, I'm missing every crate imaginable. This is not good. I mean, that's if I'm... That's if I'm holding boost. But... Of course, I'm gonna have to hold boost. I'm just gonna... That's a lot of crates. Wow. Again, just memorize where they are and we'll be fine, right? Aku. Wait. There's a three crate up there. Oh. That means I've got to go up there. Man, they put so much crates on this level. What the fuck are they thinking? You think I can see all that? Oh, and there's one underneath, so I missed that too. And I just missed a one crate. Twenty-two seconds. Shall I restart? I mean, I think we did good. I think we missed four or five crates. Which sounds like a lot, but it's really not hard to memorize the location of them. This bit is not about memorization. This is just about using your eyes. Because the I can see all these. How do I get up there if the guy is down on the pad? Nice. Missed one. Yeah. I'll keep going. Still need to memorize the location of the others. Oh, I missed the that three crate is at the very very far right hand side. Nope. Nope. What's that? Best score? There's 21 at least. How do you get the one and the three crate? You know what? Maybe I'll just opt to get the three crate. Oh, I, uh, man. Okay, my, my goal was to jump like and then land in there. Because obviously if I just, if I don't jump, I'm just going to go up anyway. I'm going to hit the plank. I had the right idea. That definitely works. I just didn't... I just jumped way too early. That's a new one. You can miss both of them. Probably worth like not using the speed boost. Oh, that's good. That's a good time. That's 17 seconds. That might be platinum. Nice. Okay. Wow, that's a really bad time. That is a terrible. I might actually redo that at some point because I missed four seconds, five seconds worth of crates. Wow, that was shit. That was, that was shit. I'm not even happy about that, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, it's platinum, but holy shit, was it a bad time. Level number four. Boneyard. So this is a runaway level. It's going to be about memorizing the level. 
and where things are. Pretty good start, actually. I'm trying so hard right now to just see at the bottom of my camera. Man, you get a lot of vacuum crates in this level. Good to see that's no different. Okay, I don't need to get that because the thing will get it for me. Triceratops. Wait, I've got no Akraku. I'm being a bit reckless here. One twenty-three. Wow, that was a lot better than my other score, at least. Okay, we can do that much better. That was pretty good for a first attempt. That wasn't for Mr. Mr. Good Aku at the very beginning. See that that beginning part's really good. You, everything lines up very well. And if I had the Aku, I could have dodged that too. Oh, it still slows you down. I didn't know. Got to be careful. Oh, that's exactly what I was warning myself about. I was, uh, I was saying, I've got to be careful. I've got two Akus, but if I hit anything, I'm going to get bounced in the air. And if I continuously slide jump, I'm going to just belly flop, flop. So, I mean, what was that? 120? That's... Oh. What, what was my previous score? This the whole thing has just been... This whole video has just been me pleasantly surprised by everything. What was my previous score that I thought I had one? Oh, it was a 123. Okay, so I was very close on my first attempt. Holy shit, man. I'm blasting through these. Let's just try and get one more for the video. I mean, let's try and get the final level done. But it's a jet ski level. Oh, okay. I'm, I might need to get used to the controls as well. Because uh, I did not make that at all. <laughs> Turning's very odd. You know, even on the shit relics, there's still some positive things you can take away from them. That's the fact that we're playing Crash Warped. I mean, this is no doubt the best game in the trilogy. Give me that double accu. I see that hidden crate.
these controls are so sensitive. I'm, am I boosting? Uh, or going as... I just missed five seconds. Is there any boosting mechanic here? Right, I think that would have been platinum had I gotten the five second grates. What was my previous time? Wait, I've done that faster. I've done that faster before. Holy shit, how am I not getting that? How am I not getting that? That's... Like, that's be I, it's better than my first time, that's good. But, hmm, that's really odd. Okay, then I guess we'll just gotta cut corners. I don't know what Platinum is, it's not gonna be much faster than 58. I think it's probably a 56, 7 maybe. Well, we'll find out. If I get like a 56 and it isn't Platinum, I'm actually gonna exit out the le level just to check. Because uh, that will be... I mean, I can find a way to save a few seconds. You just gotta cut corners as much as humanly possible. In fact, that crate is doing the exact opposite of that, but I do save a second by collecting it, I suppose. Again, just hug the walls. Issues. Let's make sure we get these again. This is a 57. Fuck, man! Even a 57! Holy shit! What is the platinum time for this level? Man! I'm either missing a boost mechanic. Or I'm just not doing something right. I mean, or I'm just slow. Maybe it's just a difficult time. Ever think about that? Not every time in this game is going to be easy. This could just be one of them. I'd say it's a fun level, though. Like, there's nothing... There's nothing really terrible about, like, the level itself. You know what? I'm going to hug this wall. I think that's... I mean, I don't know, the, the one crate is on the very edge of the arena. I don't see... i probably just save a second by not collecting it anyway. So I might try and do that instead. See what I mean? We'll see anyway. If we finish the level, we'll see what time we end up with. And if it's faster, then I'll keep with that strap. Or the good ending would be I just end up with a faster time and get platinum and don't have to do it again. That's certainly not going to happen now. So grab the Aku. Hook that guy's boat. It feels so much quicker. I just hope I can finish the level again. The controls are really good on this, actually. They were a bit sensitive, but I'm really liking them now. This bit a little bit. There we go. 
Right, let's see. 54. 56. That is a... What? There's no way! What is the pla- I'm gonna have to- Let me not restart the trial. Because... If this is- I, I, need, I need to see. I have to. Because, like, what did I- What the- That was faster, though. Without picking up that one crate at the beginning and cutting the corner, it was faster. So... But it still wasn't fast enough, so let's see. Fifth- Oh. Wow. We're talking about less than a second here. Is how much- Okay, so this is just a tough time. This one is just a tough time. That's simply what it comes down to. This is a tough time. I mean, I cut every fucking corner possible. Every corner imaginable. We're talking about milliseconds here. I mean... Wow. That's, uh... Yeah, that's, that's a tough one. Well, I'm on the right track, because, you know. Ooh. Oh, yeah, no. Uh, this is different, because this is a fresh... The cycle when you load into a level is different to when you restart. So, that should not have been there. I should not have lost my Aku, but I did. And there's nothing I can do about that. Wow, I got close. At least I gain another one here. Bollocks. See, the problem is you've got to, like, go on these as quick as possible. And it's hard to line yourself up when you do that. Wow, that's uh, one of the toughest times in the trilogy so far. Seriously. I mean, there's not much else you can do to, to be faster at this level. I could, like, ignore this one crate, but it, that would feel a bit too far. It's, like, partially out of the way, but not too much. Again, we're talking about saving a couple milliseconds here. Wait, why is the cycle different all of a sudden? This was a restart, why is it different? I was hoping my iframes would continue there. Again, that's going to come back. It's fine. I'm going to lose it again. No, I'm not. But that's very... I mean, we're saving milliseconds here. That's That definitely was a few milliseconds that I wasted. You don't know till you finish a level. Fifth oh my god. Oh my god. It's a fifty six point two. I got the fifty six point four. This is genuinely one of the most difficult relics in the game so far. That's gonna... It's that one bomb, it's like in... It's the one bit where I'm like, I don't know if I should go left or right.
actually got them. Very awkwardly, but... Is it ever quicker to just damage boost one of these bombs? So I'm not really using my Akus for much, except for like... Accidentally. I could purposely use them. Like here, maybe? Yes, that was it. Nice. Okay, cool. That was a really fun level. This whole warp room was good. None of them had strict times except for this level, but this level was uh, just a solid level overall, so didn't feel terrible. It actually felt like I wanted to cut corners as much as possible. I wanted to improve my time as much as possible. That was all good. That was the most successful relic video probably of all time. I mean, we got five relics, which means in the next video, we can move on to the second warp room. Thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here and I will see you all in part two.